What's up, YouTube? I'm back. How do I look? Do I look good? Yeah, this is a good great. angle. All right, all right, good. I'm teaching you a magic trick. Learn this one well. Learn it well. It's cool. I'll give you an example first, okay? All right, you ready? So I'm gonna pull any card out of this deck. It doesn't. I'll just boom, pop that card down. That's my card. That's not your card. You. It's mine. It's mine right here. Okay. That's my card. And uh, B, would you like to be the the volunteer for this trick? I got gotcha. you. All right, all right. What what you wanna do is you wanna turn the deck over, and just start sorting through all the cards, nice and slow. Give the person you're doing it on a lot of time, and just tell me when to stop. Anytime. Stop. Right now? Are you sure? Yeah. You sure you don't want me to put this ace down? I can make it like. Nope. Really? Alright, alright, fine. That is where I'll stop. Alright, then you ask them, which of these two piles do you like more? I like the big one. The big one? Alright. You want to take the top card of whichever pile they choose, turn that bad boy over. It was an eight. You want to pick up the other pile, count out that many cards. Dude, I'm moving this paper a lot. One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You see that shit right there? Crazy how I can count. I can do I can do basic arithmetic. It's kind of hot. Um. All right, and now is the part where you fucking blow their mind. Okay, you'd be like, hmm. I wonder what this card is. Psych, bitch. That's an eight. Yeah. Wait, wait. Oh. Oh, wait, that's so weird. Then they're all eights. And then you've you've blown their mind adequately. And now I'm gonna teach you how to how to do this trick. V, you gotta focus too. Okay. You know, so take four of any card in the deck. Preferably in the range of six to eight. It works best. It's less conspicuous. And you wanna just wanna get all four of them? And yeah, that's all. That's the trick. <laughs> <laughs> you just have four cards. Psych, you thought. All right. I'm actually going to teach you this really good now because it's for a video. All right, you ready? Take the stack of cards. Take two of the eights or whatever card you're using and insert them onto the top of the deck. And then you want to turn the deck over and count out seven or you count out one minus however many this is whatever you're doing you could be eight seven six five whatever uh one minus or this minus one so i'm going to count out seven cards so one two three four five six seven perfecto and you want to take the remaining two cards which eights for this example and you want to put them right there beautiful and you want to take all these and put them back. And then you want to do a little showbiz. You want to you want to jazz them up a bit. You want to be like, all right, this doesn't really matter. This part of the trick, you can you know, fake shuffle, do whatever you would do with your magic stuff. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And eventually, you start the trick and you just be nonchalant. Spread out the deck, be like, all right, this be my card. And you purposely put down the second to top card because you already know what that is. These are both eights. Put down that second to top card, and you're like, alright, that's my fucking card. Don't, don't even worry about it. Do that nice and quick, throw off their focus, and then boom. This this is the important part. So you want to you wanna talk them up. Riz them up for a bit, some might say. Not me, though. That's uh, Never be said really. It. I hate the word riz. I feel like people who use the word riz don't have charisma. Alright. And you want to start just slowly going through this and just talk to them. Be like, hey. I'm slowly going to go through all of these. I just need you to tell me when to stop. But you want to make sure that you place both of whatever card you have already. So now, once both of those are down, they can tell you to stop at any point in the fucking presentation. If they're annoying, they're going to get you to, like, here. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter at all. Okay? Are you understanding the trick a bit more now? Or no? Yeah. Yeah? All right, sweet. All right. Let's say they stay stopped there. Coolio. You need to remember that this deck right here, the top card on it, is going to be an 8 no matter what. Okay? Then you turn this over, and 
at the very beginning, when you flipped over the deck and you went seven in and you put both of those eights, you conveniently put both of those eights right there. Oh, I'm tired. Okay. And now you ask them, which of these two decks do you like more? If you're lucky, they just say the one that already has the eight on top, and this fucking trick goes perfectly. If they're not lucky, you just do it really quick, and like, let's say they're, they're like, I like that deck. You say, alright, well you always go with the opposite one. So no matter what, you're flipping over this top card. But if they choose this deck, you flip over the top card, perfect. And now what you do, is you count out however many it is. It's eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And, and now they're all eights. You guys can believe me, I don't need to turn them over. Turn them over. Oh. Bam, bam, and that's how you magic. But the the secret that I uh didn't include in this is you uh you've actually got a fuck. Do I tell them what the true secret? What is it? Um. All right, that's it. That's that's how you do it. Man.